So we're gonna be doing something a little different with this first person VOD and uh, just uh, be commentating over it. This was recorded during the semifinals of the Coach Pupil League. This will be game one of me versus uh, Sandersi. And um, yeah. It's going to be a Protoss versus Zerg match, and then uh, basically, it's a bit of an interesting sort of match. So I was talking in the in the team wing in, in the Discord chat of like, it's the finals. I've been playing super standard all season. I ha I, I have to cheese, and so I go into this game like, uh, basically having said all week I'm gonna cannon rush on Shakur's temple. And I'm gonna figure out what to do from there. So, um, it's very, uh, very interesting. Kind of just really super basic. Um, I think my probe split there was pretty good, so that's all right. And I'm just kind of just spamming clicks to like warm up, warm up my hand. So this is like the super basic timing, I actually think I might have misplaced my pylon here. Like you can tell I'm kind of, I'm un unsure actually, super did not practice enough for this, uh, for the map. Um, like near the start of the season I had laid out sort of all the, I practiced all the different um, wall combinations for this map, but I kind of like uh, didn't practice enough this week and so I, I kind of have that uh, whole hesitation. Um, we're gonna get a 10 forge. As you can see it's just I, I further just have no idea. Um, and then we send the probe out and then we just uh, keep looking because we want the probe to scout essentially as soon as possible. And then with our next guy um, we actually are sending him out like super early because it's a cannon rush and we absolutely uh, like need to get the scout out. I think I'm gonna I, like he, he basically throws down a cannon to kind of keep me safe if it's something too bad. And then um like if the Zerg is attacking and I see the Overlord, I'm like okay, um I know where he's uh, coming from now. I know where his base is at. I think I send the initial scouting probe across the map over there, and we're gonna see what the uh, Senderzi is making. Um, we spot the hatchery being made, and I think our probe just barely like our the residual uh, field of like view is like I, I, uh, I was able to see the Zerglings like coming to attack right as a. Uh, I think I, and I pulled seven probes here. I don't know if that's the right amount. I think I pulled way too many. I think I probably send yeah, I send two back, so I've only sent five. And then I just scout the base to see what's going on. Um, yeah. So with the two cannons and the probes kind of blocking everything, I think we're pretty safe. And then because of the hatchery's low vision I'm, I'm feeling pretty good that my uh, I have the probe in the main who's distracting and the probe in the natural is kind of being the sneaky one and sending all the uh, putting the, the cannons down um so we've sort of invested like oh god we actually probably made too many cannons I think we probably could have gotten away with just having the one cannon in the main if I had left all enough probes there and then we're getting the gateway before Nexus because I don't want to like be too far behind. Maybe I should have gotten Nexus before gateway, but hatchery finished, and we have yeah. We're just gonna go up to three cannons in the natural. I don't think that was like entirely super optimal, but I think we probably could have left it at two cannons and been fine. We would have. I, I see more zerglings coming out, so I'm like okay. I need to pull more probes because I imagine he's trying to like, in my head, I think he's probably just sending a bunch of zerglings over to try and kill me. And I'm just uh, playing like basically one base play at this point. Let's go 
going lair. Um, so I, I in practice, I did. We did find out like if you get the cancel, the Zerg probably goes um, uh, Mudas and Mutalisks, but like they take their, th they just go and take their third, and then they get Mutalisks. So I'm pretty like aware of what's going on. Problem is, I'm like kind of really far behind tech wise. And this is just cheeky. I want to see if I can get away with that. If I can can rush the third as well, and then I try to can rush the mage. Yeah, which you don't. I so I get the cancel. I don't like invest too much in it. And I basically, I needed to probably throw a pylon in my main around this time. Like just use those minerals. I, I think I got too focused on being cheeky because you can see I don't have like the the real estate. <laughs> to build the Stargate anywhere and just kind of goes up there, which is really kind of nasty. I w would have wanted it in my main base. Um, also, I'm going to like go scout in and then we're going to see the Spire and I just back out. So like, I think, yeah, I start building the cannons for the main. I, I'm like, I don't know, I feel like I'm in a good position. Um, we're probably on like Two base, yeah. I'm about to. Yeah, I wanted to go to Stargate, but I think I, I I opted to get the expansion because I really need it. Then, hold on. Where is it? Yep. <laughs> yeah. So I lose this game. Uh, in case you're wondering watching this for six minutes and I, I just straight up lose and I, I go okay do I restart the Stargate or I, I, I just get the Citadel because I'm like okay I have to like hail me or something like I, I, there's there's no way to win like if I rebuild the Stargate I'm pretty sure I definitely lose so that's that Templar Archives because theoretically, since I cancelled the Stargate, I could maybe get an Archon out to help me with Mutalisks, but like I said, at this point we're Hail Mary. There's no way that, uh, that I don't die here. Like, it would take Here, these are a little bit. I could maybe have been spamming the cannons down like a crazy person, which is possible. Maybe the Kinderi could have lived commit. So that's, I think, four mutalisks, five mutalisks, six. That one rallied from the third base. So six mutalists. I think if I had spammed like maybe two more cannons in my main base, I would have won that game. So yeah, I was pretty salty after that. 